in March, a new uh, flexible spending account uh, arrangement for our employees. Cost, cost the employee virtually nothing at the first year. We you know, have a set up fee of $500. And basically, it allows every employee that participates in our health plan, uh, you know, everybody still has, all employees still have co pays to pay and, and some other things that are not covered you know, by the health plan. Uh, this FSA, if you have, will allow our employees to withhold from their paychecks uh, free tax dollars so they can then use, they can pay those co pays and prescriptions and some other things with free tax dollars instead of, uh, uh, you know, post tax dollars, which is just a, it's just a good benefit for our employees. Uh, there's, there's a $500 fee. Set up. After that, there's just a seven dollar administrative fee per month per employee. So we're probably talking about five or six people. But the good news is that uh, once they start uh, deducting amounts from their payroll checks, we also don't have to match FICA uh, or Medicare, you know, on those pre-tax benefits. So that kind of pays most of our seven dollar per month for the employees. So once we get it set up, it's, it's a good benefit for the employees at, at first at very little cost to the company. So I just didn't see any sense. Once I found out it was available to us and we could participate in it at, at a very low cost, I thought that's just a great thing for the employees. And, uh, the, uh, and it's well within, it, it, like I said, $500 fee. Is, I just want to let the board uh, you know that we've done that. Uh, but uh, I do need board approval. We do have to do, since all that's handled uh, online, they basically issue debit cards to the employees that participate. And they just use the debit cards and then pay their copay at the drugstore or whatever at the doctor's office. But again, the place of issues that uh, we're working with a Paragon uh, group, which came to us through uh, Company hands all of our employee benefits because they, they work with them. But this is just a banking agreement to allow us to do online internet banking with the bank for bank, which is just use a debit card. So we can we can you know establish that fund with an account. We'll probably put a couple thousand dollars into initially just to have it as a reserve, and then just month to month we'll move funds into it. As it, as, it, as the deductions come from employees' payroll checks, we'll simply fund it to that account. So again, virtually no cost to the company once it's established. I just need the board to approve uh, the bank for bank uh, internet banking enrollment form for the uh, conference center and tourism authority. Okay, oh, and I, I would say uh, on that, uh, and, and it's not really seen that we don't sign stuff, we don't sign checks with that, but uh, I do have margin myself as, as the people authorized to you know transact business with the bank or you know take phone calls and answer questions about it. 